Hello, this is the RPG Crawler, and welcome back to my Let's Play of Pillars of Eternity 2 Deadfire. And I guess I'm looting this place because these guys decided to go kill on sight to me. You know, I asked myself, am I the baddie here? I just walked in. They're the ones that started attacking me. If they didn't want to all die, then they shouldn't have attacked me. Some real minor art, minor ma magic items here. Alright, minor supplies. Have we got anything down here? No. Let's see what's down here. The hell is this? Anything down here? Leave it to me. This copper brazier reeks of ashes and burnt hair. Oh. A layer of soot and detritus line the blackened concavity. Concavity. Examine the brazier. Among the ashes, you find charred fruit pits, scraps of parchment, sh shards of pottery, animal bones, and matted bundles of singed hair. Okay, this is where they burn their sacrifices. This mirror is quite faded, but you still recognize the sick silhouette of Teos X Arcanon, who is the villain from the first one, so I'm feeling less bad about. You know, basically genociding these people. Okay. Let's go back to the bedchamber here. Loot this. I'll see it. Okay, we got a charm belt again, an exceptional spear, yeah, nothing major. Well, I mean, I guess I just gotta leave now. Let's step outside, see if we got a, a an angry mob out there. We have an angry mob out here. Okay. <laughs> that was... That was funny. Okay, let's see what we can do here. You know what? If I'm gonna be the baddies, I may as well go for it. Alright, if she's uh Let's go ahead and own this dude. Oh obliterated. Little tiny bird just just exploding these things. Come on. Oh, they're casting Spreading Plague. No! <laughs> okay. I am going to need to rest after this. Yeah, um I've got this, Captain. The shaman's gonna yeah. be the real pain. I'll think we're the wrong. Come on, RPG crawler. Take care who 
powers to command, Captain. Um. Want to paralyze this one, please? She's a. Okay. Maya, go ahead and take this one down, please. Let's interrupt him. Thank you. Boom. Oh, they're still alive? Alright, Palagina. That's a nice hit. I mean, do I have a point blank area of effect thing? I'm pretty sure I do, don't I? Let's try and take these ones down. Oh, he's petrified, but he's also exploded. Why are you carrying so many eggs? Surely they'll, they'll, they will spoil. No, they won't, oddly enough. I'm doing more damage to my own people with my AEs than I am to uh, than they are, basically. Oh. We got somebody else that comes onto view. Yeah, let's, uh... Let's shark mode. We'll take this one down. Happy to oblige. Hey, can we just heal? Yeah. That's all we need. Alright, Maya, you wanna take one of these out, please? Seen anyone brood as forcefully as your bird? All right, RBG crawler, what are we gonna do with you? We're just gonna magic missile this dude down. Yoshizu, finish this one off, oh, or not? I am ready. Palagina. Oh my God, he's still alive. Lion Companion is still on fire. Yes, Captain. Or not anymore. <laughs> Own. You'll threaten the scout? Finish this one, please. Oh, so close! Speak freely. Maya, finish this one. Shody. Yes. RPG crawler, let's uh let's do your magic missiles on this guy. Palagina. Just fireball this guy from afar. And then she's a uh, Take this guy down. Yes. Alright, let's see what the mob had. Aloth is going to be so angry at me, I suspect. Because he was trying to redeem all these people. Alright, we're going to grab this. Leave it to me. Uh, quick save the game. Yep. Yeah. More villagers to slay. We have a lot of villagers coming up. Yes, we do. Kill zone time. Just gonna kill the entire village, aren't we? We're just gonna massacre the entire village, aren't we?
This is not what we came here to do, but if we gotta do it, <laughs> we gotta do it. Do I get my dark side powers after this? I need all of these villagers to just come stand together and maybe gather your women and children all together too so that, that I can get you all in one nice little overlapping or area of effect here. Coming from all the way across the map here. They're like intruders, intruders. Okay. What is it? Yeah, I need you to do uh what is it? That that cloud cloud kill copy. Oh! A couple of them froze and shatter. Yeah, you need to come out here. I've got this, Captain. No, you don't. You missed. What are you coming that way for? You like stuck in a loop, a pathfinding loop? Come on, I need more of you to run in here. Ow, you stabbed my bird for four. Come on. Everybody, come on up. Ah, uh, stop running back and forth. Wicked Briars. Oh, there goes there goes another one. I'm gonna do uh, Blizzard. We're gonna do the. Uh, this one. Malignant Cloud is up. Come on. The more the merrier. Get you all up in here. Go ahead and drop a fireball. You can point blank this guy. Finish this one? Nope. Well, there goes a couple of them, or at least one of them. You just gonna run back and forth over there? Just uh, gathering up in a little clump here nice and easy come on more the merrier I see you guys running up here getting these villagers in the fireball range come on everybody get up Hobbled. Boom! <laughs> Multi kill. Oh! Boom! All right, Jody. Must you travel with every godlike in the Let's Go ahead and hammer these. 
Hammer. Yes, Captain. Uh, where's your blast spell? Boiling spray. There we go. Yes. Ah. Uh, well. How about we delay fireball over here? Alright, Maya. I've got this, Captain. Point blank. We just finish this one. You guys not gonna come up here? They're just running back and forth over here. <sighs> well, we got a shaman. We got two that are just running back and forth down there. That's not. That's not good. And here comes another one. All right, got your delayed blast fireball up for those who still haven't joined the party yet. Happy to oblige. How about I just do a quick heal? Did you know you reek of that hagfish you carry? Dispose of it. I'm just once. waiting to see if these guys actually come up from below. Boom! There goes that. Can we fire or can we magic missile this one down? Yes, we can. You were saying? I am ready. So there's just the one left. You were saying? Great. No, there's two left. Are they just gonna go back and forth the over there? Will take what remains of your soul. See, because either way, I kind of need to wait for all this stuff to, to die down. Okay. Jody, come out here. Ashiza, come along down here. Your orders. Maya. All right. Oh, there's a hunter or whatever. Come on. Well. You gonna come into view, please? Yeah, we got a villager. Mm -hmm. Alright, Jody. Let's try and get... Alright, we got both of these. Good. Um, try and hammer this. Maya... Miss. Yes, Captain. You can't hit them on an incline, I don't think. Shizu, come over here. Palagina, come over here. And pepper this one with fireballs. RPG crawler. It's got a nice little fireballs. Yeah, let's get fireball. Down here. Come on, villager. Man, that is one brave villager. <coughs> Boom. Alright, scout. It's on you. You're going to shoot the bird. Okay. Well, guess what? Bird's going to come after you. Pillar of Faith. Owned by a cleric. What can I do you for? What can I do you for? Alright. All Let's right. just grab what we can from the loot. You know, if they're gonna make us kill them, at least they're gonna have to make it worth our while to loot their village. Oh, I hope these guys weren't important for anything. Do I gotta quick save the game in a little bit? I probably do. It's probably a bunch of quests and stuff that I'm missing out on. 
Like some special contacts. I probably uh, angered Aleph. Intruders! Your bones will feed the land. Yeah. Yeah, that's Jody. Show them where it's at. Oh! She's like, intruders! <laughs> she didn't hear that big commotion that killed, like, literally two-thirds of the village. Oh, what's that? Oh, that's where I should have probably come in at, then. Uh -huh. Okay, so maybe they were angry because I snuck into their village. Or maybe they were angry because I killed some of them in an earlier quest. Oh, well. Let's go down to the next one down. Man, we are just... This wooden lift grants access to the towering cliffs separating the settlement above from the jungle below. The lift is currently raised level of the plateau. Take the lift down to the ground. The lift strains against the rope binding it, but the pulley bears you slowly to the ground. Alright, well we can loot up. Let's loot up. Leave it to me. So yeah, that might have been a little bit overkill. I might have messed myself out of some stuff, but you know what? It was worth it. All right. Well, now that we have, now that we apparently have no more allies to help us with these slavers, I guess uh, we've got to go to Crookspur and do the same thing there. You know, just to balance things out. Neutral on the galactic scale, I suppose you could say. Let's get that shipwreck first, though. Uh, Imperial Long Gun. Oh, for the ship. Alright, let's see. Ah, Crook's Spur Captain's down here. Crook's Spur is down here. Bent Bow Forest. Vampire's Crypt. Is this one of the islands I'm supposed to... I'm finding a number of islands that have interesting things on them. So here's Crookspur Island. I'm gonna sail around it real quick to get on the map because I strongly, although I, I don't know, I've got like 10 minutes. If it just turns into a massive combat though, I don't know. There's a Royal Deadfire Company ship. Alright, let's let's set let's set down on the southern tip of the island. Let's go ahead and take down Bleak Rock let's go to Bleak Rock Shrine. You notice a small pavilion containing a large weathered statue of a stone a little ways off the path. It appears to be a appears to be a Hawana shrine. Approach and identify it. Show, uh, Jody, show me why you have religion. It portrays Rekihu, the Juana's rendition of Barath. An inscription runs along the shrine's base. Some flee, others fight, or Rekihu consumes all. Pray at the shrine and rest. You kneel before the shrine and begin to pray. You have only been at a short time when you hear footsteps behind you. A group of smirking slavers have approached. Each bears arms and armor, and they look well accustomed to hard fighting. Well, would you look at this, boys, one asks. His accent marking him as a red saren. You notice he wears, uh, he's sewn to his shirt, a badge marking him as a follower of Barath. Seems we done our, got ourselves a sacrifice. Uh, does this really look like someone you want to start trouble with? The man looks at you, turns his head and spits, then looks at you again. Well then, maybe there ain't profit in this. I thought there were. He waves off the others. Let's go, boys. Leave these folks to their praying. They move away, leaving to pray at the shrine. When you rise, you do so with a renewed sense of resolve. Okay. Can I continue in? I can't I can't go through here. It it's cut you off. It cuts you off. You gotta go to the You gotta go to Crooksburg to get to the other side. I'll tell you what. 
we are going to quick save the game. And we're going to go in here. And if this immediately jumps us into a massive fight... Alright, hold on. Is this guy coming after me? I mean, I'll fight him if he wants, but I think I'm just going to go over here to Crookspur. Am I killing sight in Crookspur Island? I guess we'll find out then. Find and kill a master cow in, in Cooksburg. Let's talk to the merchant. Have a look right away. What you got? You got Helm of the Falcon. Um, that could be an upgrade for somebody. I think I'm gonna grab that for uh for what's her face. Patinated plate. It's a legendary armor. It's heavy, but it's got a rebound thing. And you got Grave Calling, um, Legendary. Gives freeze damage, and accuracy against vessels. So I'll tell you what, we'll just get this, and we will sell. Put these pistols down there. Um, scepter. Move from the stash, we'll go ahead and drop exceptional, fine, 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 exceptional, and there we go, we'll trade it. And that will go for a Palagina. Alright, where, where did we get that then? Where's the hat? Where, where, where's the thing I just bought? Is it on uh, RPG Crawler? Did it go in the stash? Alright. This is when you got it. Oh my god. I'm not finding it. Oh wait, Jody's got it for some reason. Alright, oh, she can't even wear a helm. I forgot, I totally forgot. She's a godkin. Oh. Well... You know what? That's all right. I bought a completely useless helmet because I forgot she was a god king. No, I, I, don't, I don't need to unlock that. The wood of these support beams still smells fresh. Move Never customer. What to your old pets, yeah, I don't. Uh, it's enough, dude. You're going to ask me too much, Console Hot, and I'm going to put you in a barrel with fish. You there, approaching. The guard sneers, fat lips peeling back from his yellow teeth. He grunts, muscles flex and pop in his thick-set neck as he cranes for a better look at you. You are late. The auction is almost over. Then hurry and let me through. If anyone is to hurry, it should be you. I grow tired of opening and closing the gate. His chest heaves as he cranks the winch to raise the heavy grating. Take care that I do not drop it as you walk beneath. No problem, my dude. Thank you for opening it. See, Norma. At last we reach the culmination of our lot today. A stiff-backed woman gestures wildly with her arms, gathering the crowd a hair closer. Excitement simmers in buzzing voices and the low rattle of raffia head fans. Anticipation hangs in the air. Then with a flick of her prim wrist, she hastens the final slave to step forward. He's a strapping, ugly-faced misborn. 
chains and planks of the stage rattling with each of his heavy steps. Feast your eyes on a fruit most rare. The auctioneer's lips curl in a cruel little smile. Velico will open the bidding at 800 pies, 800 pies, 800 right here, and 850, who will give me 850, 875, I'm at 875. She points to the various bidders who raise their number of fans, never pausing in her lilting chant. What a putrid thing. The words are cutting, but the buyer's fan snaps up eagerly. We've got 875 and now 900. Who will bid us 900? Bid 900. Now we're at 950. Do I see 950? And I do. And we're up to 975. Where's my 975? There it is. And who will give me 1,000? Bid 1,000. If possible, the action is rambling chant increases the speed from a drumming excitement. Her hand bounces with the words of riding a beat. The price is up to 1,000 pyres. Do nothing. 11, 100. The number is raised with a flick of a fan. 100? Do we have two? Can I get to two? Impatient now, the auctioneer waves a hand for the death godlike to bow his head, presumably to showcase his recurve gleaming horns. Instead, he stares at her, looking like he could he spit venom. Number 24 shakes his head, others in the crowd rumble their agreement. The what a fine statement they'd make. The woman smiles. Wait a minute! I... The words are true. I didn't get a chance to? Yeah, bid 1200. And now it's 11, 200 to the bid with no number. How odd, it's a delightful mystery. Wait, what? 11, 200, do I have three? Oh, okay. Yeah, that's me. The bitter eyes you with annoyance. Agitate, she taps her fan rapidly against her thigh, but ultimately refrains from raising it. 11, 200 pyres, once, twice, sold to our mystery bidder. Gelarde, I do hope you possess the sufficient funds for your sake as well as mine. Dude, I got enough to buy you. Come here now, we will finalize the trade. All right, yeah, let's get this... Perfecto. Let us close this deal. All right. Good day, my lord master. The auctioneer inclines her head to the shackled godlike. You are a first-time buyer, huh? for I do not recognize you as one of our usual patrons. Hmm. Come to address your personnel problems. Her eyes narrow with understanding. The master has been expecting you. Go. You will find him within the residence. Hey, no problem. And, uh... Good day, my lord master. Can we, like, let this dude go or whatever? Alright. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to wrap it up here. And we will continue uh, next time. This has been the RPG Car with my last pay of Pillars of Eternity 2. If you like what you're seeing, remember to leave a like, comment, any feedback, and subscribe for more RPG content. Until next time, take care and goodbye. And if you are still watching, I would like to take the opportunity to thank my supporters, the top tiers of which are listed on the screen, without whose support I would not have been able to offer the variety of content that I have on this channel throughout the years. If you're feeling particularly generous and would like to join them, you can support the channel. There are a variety of options to do so. I have a Patreon, a Subscribestar, as well as channel memberships enabled. If you are not in a position to contribute, simply leaving a like, a comment, or sharing my videos are all wonderful ways to help the channel grow without spending a dime, and are all greatly appreciated.